The Creative Z egg just got a firmware update for the developers. They have added a camera application um, which does video as well as still photos. I've posted some samples of these on anythingbutipod.com. Check those out there. Um, there's also a sample video on the YouTube account as well. Um, here is your regular camera application. Kind of nice. There's the button on the top. Actually works pretty comfortably as a camera. Take the picture there. Okay. Um, and then your video camera and then also the forward facing camera which is available there. You can snap the photo like that as well. Additionally, what they also added in the firmware is a couple of different effects to the UI. So this is the they're calling it a 3D clothesline effect. When you then this only works in landscape mode. So when you flip this in landscape mode, um, here is the 3D clothesline effect. So this works in your, for your album art as well as your photos. Um, might even work for video too. I haven't tried that yet. Um, it just kind of blows in the wind. Just kind of shows off these processing power. The other thing they added was a um, snap effect to different lists. Mm, this is a little bit, this is their take on the reaching the end of the list. So you have your typical scroll and when you get to the end of the list, it'll stretch and snap. Um, if you're familiar with any other touch screen players, all the other touch screen players do a snap, kind of snap back. They don't do the stretching. Um, so, for instance, here on the Zoom HD, you get this. They don't stretch. And that's the same thing with the iPod Touch and actually the Koan S9 does the same thing. When you get to the end of the list, it'll snap back like that, as opposed to the stretching. Don't know if I like that yet or not, but um, I'll have to reserve judgment to when the final firmware drops, consumer firmware drops. Um, again, I want to stress that this is still very, um, not too far along still in the development process so it's still a long way from um, a consumer product so that's why you see a lot of these, these screens are extremely slow oh, is slow so once it picks up more speed and stuff they'll be a lot nicer that's it for them